It's good YouTube, Nath Mask Collector, back with another Mail Week video. If you guys haven't subscribed yet to the channel, I would really appreciate it if you did that. If you if you checked out my content before, or if you're new and you know checking things out, um, I go through all kinds of different things, mainly sports cards that I'm picking up and submitting for grading and flipping for profit. Um, trying to target like a lot of the low population stuff, some of the obscure things. Um, if you check all my videos, you'll you'll understand what I'm talking about. But um, like the video, just hit the like, the thumbs up, and then hit the bell for uh, notifications of new content when I put them out. So let's get started on this. Um, so <clears throat> I ventured into football just a little bit. So kind of targeting just Hall of Fame players. Um, I don't want to chase uh, a lot of the new rookies. They're just way too, way too expensive and unproven, frankly. So I'm sticking with the vintage and uh, vintage, you know, meaning anything uh, for Hall of Fame players or, or, you know, pretty much guaranteed Hall of Fame players. So Peyton Manning, this is a second year card, Bowen's best honor roll. And I found this one on eBay when I was searching for the basketball honor roll stuff. So it just kind of popped up and I'm like, hey, you know, second year card, shit. It'll probably be a, a good little insert to have at some point. So it's refractor, Bowman's best, it's really nice looking card, a little off centered, but still looks cool. Um, and then I uh, been buying these top crop cards um i was going through my my collection from when i was younger and i ran into a couple of these this one here as a matter of fact i actually sent this one off to get graded one just like this so check on one side this is from 1990 um god what year is it 1996 Top Stadium Club, top crop. So, Shaq on one side, Akeem Olajuwon on the other. Um, I picked up three of these, four of these. Um, there's definitely some of these in the series that are better than others, this being one of them. Um, Patrick Ewing, sorry about the crappy top loader, but it's Patrick Ewing on this side. Uh, David Robinson on this side. And I got a couple of those. Uh, this one here is the fifth one in the series, Scotty Pippen and Sean Kemp. This one here, number six, uh, Carl Malone and then Baker. But Carl Malone I've been targeting lately. Um, this one here looks like it's off printed or something because you can see how it looks like a double vision there. Juwan Howard and Charles Barkley. A couple of those. But they look really cool, you know, they're, they're pretty sweet little inserts and I'm thinking the population report's really low on these, uh, mainly because they're just a, probably really hard to grade and get high grades on them because they're two-sided. Um, face on both sides basically and uh can be little imperfections on both sides that will just knock it down quite a bit um and then i got some of these michael jordan uh, nba hoops east um, all-star east mvp from 1988 all-star weekend though this is a 1991 nba hoops insert of some sort i've never seen this until recently um, and I think that's what draw me to it is that I, one, I didn't have it when I was collecting as a kid and, um, to it, it's an insert and, um, it's Michael Jordan. So I'll have to look it up a little bit more, but it's got a Roman numeral up here, but I've seen some graded and they're going for decent money. So I picked up some raw ones. Uh, this one here is the Pro Vision from 91 Fleer. Uh, it's centered really 
really well for this series of cards. Um, if you, anybody knows anything about these or collected these when you were younger, it was so hard to get one that was centered really nice. Um, and this one is centered really well. It's just, I think it has some sort of uh, surface issue on it. That's why um, I didn't get it sent off yet. But that's just it. When you look at it underneath the plastic, it looks perfect. Um, then I got some more Honor Roll Bowman Best from 97. So this is, this is just the base of the set. Shaq and Alonzo. Uh, Grant Hill on this side and Dwan Howard on this side. And here are the refractors. Grant Hill, Dwan Howard. Um, these are really hard to get in nice condition. All of these are kind of, um, you know, there's no way they're going to make tens. There's probably no way they're going to make nines. There's a lot of print lines, manufacturing scratch lines, things like that in these things. Um, there's like a weird, really weird finish on it that scratches really easily. So that's why the pop population report on these is so low too. But if I see ones that are, are look really nicely centered, um, I'm taking a shot at some of them just to um, see if I can find a diamond in the rough type of thing. So Carl Malone's, um, yeah, four of these. I think three of them came together from Com C. And then Anthony Hardaway and Chris Weber. Um, I got one, a whole set of these going in a submission to PSA that I'm sending tomorrow. Um, it was one I put in before the price increase. And uh, this one here is not as good as the one I'm sending in, but they're just little scratches and print lines and stuff in them. So that. Uh, then I have some Karl Malone cards, um, a lot of the same types here, but I bought this lot of, I think there's nine or 10 of these from the Upper Deck 92, 93 series. So the Mailman, they did kind of like a fan, Fanimation series it's called, where they have um, NBA All-Stars as superheroes type of thing. So there's like uh, Jordans in the set, Larry Bird, things like that. So I, I saw these, they're all really nice condition um and like i said i've been on this Carl Malone kick for a while and uh just targeting certain cards that i think look good and one of them is these rockman cards i <laughs> just love these things this is the tops it's kind of like a shimmer type of look to it and here are the Topps Chrome version. One, two, three, four, five. Five of the Topps Chrome. And then I have one, two, three of the Topps Chrome refractors. Really cool looking cards. So you see the refractor down there in the corner. Something to look for if you can't tell on a picture or somebody has it labeled wrong on their listing. Um, so this is uh, Carl Malone's second year card. Pretty good condition, actually. You know, it's, I don't think it's going to get a 10 or anything, but it might be, might, might get some higher grade, maybe an 8. Um, this one here is a, it's like a see-through acetate type of card um 9798 key ingredient gold carl malone it's just the signature pose picture is what i really love about this this is great uh, so there's 15 in this set number six and then for carl malone i, I did i bid on this it was i bid like i don't know if it was 10 bucks or something like that. I don't know. I think it cost me 15 or 17 with shipping and everything when it's all said and done. But 88 Fleer, seven. You know, that's what it is. 
I got some Henry Allenson cards. Uh, Henry's from my hometown. And uh, Race Lake, Wisconsin. And uh, he's been kind of tearing up the G League recently. Some really high scoring games, lots of rebounds and stuff. So I went and looked up some of his rookie cards, mainly the um, silver prism refractor type of cards and uh, just picked up a bunch. I mean, they're, you know, $5 each type of thing, but you know, you just, sometimes you just never know. Um, these are numbered to 99. These purple ones, um, the blue number to 199. Got a couple gold ones that are to 75. Uh, tie dye to 25. And a couple of mosaics, one red, one silver. And I got some hoops. Um, this is out of 149, kind of like a checkerboard green or something. Um, Donruss out of 99. Another Donruss out of 99, but red. Uh, Donruss press proof out of 75. And I got a couple select autographs on card. And the select checkerboard patch card out of 10, actually. Six out of 10. So, so I got for those. Just kind of a fun thing, you know, to kind of look at. Kind of nice seeing him doing, doing well in the G League. So... More Christian Wood, some NBA hoops, um, 2021s. The purple, um, this is the teal last. Five, five of those. This one here is a green one. And yeah, numbered out of 89. Uh, silver out of 199. I got some illusion, a couple base hollows, whatever. They're cheap. Uh, certified. Status. You know, these are one, two dollar cards basically. And then for um, hoops premium stock, I got a laser, a scope, two mojos, teal prism, blue cracked ice, red cracked ice, red pulsar. Really cool. Uh, silver premium out of 149, checkerboard type thing. And then one, two, three, four, five, 11 pulsars. And that pretty much rounds it up. So thanks a lot, guys, for, for checking out the video. Um, get these put away. And what I've been doing lately is just cleaning cards and getting them ready for my submissions to PSA that I put in sending those out this week this weekend and next week so um, again if you haven't subscribed please do that'd be great and um, like the video hit the thumbs up hit that bell for notifications and we will see you in the next video thanks bye